At its core, Carbon DeFi is an on-chain limit order engine with order book-like features. Carbon DeFi services makers and takers. Makers are those who create limit orders and wait for them to be filled, while takers are those who browse the list of open orders and pick their preferred price. If you decide to create a strategy on Carbon DeFi, you are the one who decides exactly what price your assets will trade for. Makers, those who create limit orders, must deposit their liquidity into a non-custodial contract. This is required so that takers, those who execute the orders, can be 100% confident that when they go to execute a trade, there is no ambiguity of outcome. And the list of open orders is publicly available for any trader on Ethereum to take. And as for what tokens can be listed on Carbon DeFi, any standard ERC-20 token can be placed into a strategy. There is no listing process. Carbon DeFi also features range orders and overlapping liquidity, but we'll get to that later. And finally, both limit orders and range orders on Carbon DeFi can be linked together to create a strategy that will automatically execute in a recurring fashion. So let's make a strategy. I'm going to use the ETH USDC pair because it's something that most people are already familiar with. But there is no limitation on what tokens can be paired together. If you want to make an exotic trading pair, such as Chainlink YFI, you can. But there might not be any historical data for such an obscure combination. So we'll stick with ETH and USDC for now. To create a limit order, choose your tokens, click limit order, select your price, and that's it. Naturally, you will need to give your wallet permission to interact with the contracts, but as far as the Carbon DeFi side of things is concerned, you're done. Orders on Carbon DeFi can be adjusted at any time, so if you ever wish to update your prices, you do not need to withdraw or delete your strategy to update the parameters as the market moves. Now let's look at a strategy which uses two limit orders that are linked together. This is a recurring order. We will offer to sell ETH at 3800 and buy ETH at 3000 At the time of writing, ETH is about 3250 This strategy doesn't need two tokens to work. If you only have USDC, then this strategy will wait for ETH to dip before spending the USDC to buy ETH. And after the ETH has been purchased, Carbon DeFi will remember to sell any ETH it can at 3800 This pattern will continue in a cyclical fashion until the strategy is closed by the owner, or until the market permanently moves out of range. There are also range orders. Range orders are like most other concentrated liquidity positions, except they only trade in one direction. If you want to scale into an ETH position on the way down, then you can set a range to start buying ETH at 3200 and to keep buying all the way down to 3000 If you want to create a strategy to scale out of an ETH position, then set a sell range starting at 3600 going up to 3800 Just like limit orders, range orders can be linked together to create a recurring strategy. And on this channel are two animated explainer videos to show you exactly what's happening as liquidity rotates between the orders. Lastly, there is the option to create an overlapping liquidity position. This is very similar to a concentrated liquidity position, except you get to define the spread. Instead of being forced to pick from one of three different predetermined spreads, you can set your own. To see what other users are doing, click the Explore tab, enter your tokens, and browse other strategies created by other users of Carbon DeFi. You can also view the total liquidity on the trading pair in the Portfolio section and the most recent trades on that pair in the Activity section. And if you want even more information, you can go to the Simulate tab, where you can use historical price data to simulate a trading strategy. If you'd like to see a tutorial on how to use the simulator, check out this video in the upper right. The Ethereum ecosystem is overrun with MEV bots, but strategy creators on Carbon DeFi don't have to worry about things like sandwich attacks. The architect of Carbon DeFi, Dr. Mark Richardson, will be speaking at ETH Dubai on April 20th, the day of the Bitcoin block halving, and he wrote two very in-depth articles about the exact technical reasons as to how Carbon DeFi protects its users from these types of attacks, and you can find links to those articles in the description. Limit orders and range orders, overlapping liquidity, recurring trading strategies, on-chain orders, adjustability, and MEV protection are all things you can find on Carbon DeFi and the protocols which have licensed Carbon DeFi's contracts. Carbon DeFi's contracts are deployed on Ethereum and licensed and deployed on Base, Mantle, and Phantom under the name Graphene. 